Trials of Mana. The name's Hawkeye, renowned thief from Navarro. I'm Angela, Princess of Altena. I am Reese. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Where there is light, there must also be dark. So, the thieves of Navarro lived in the shadows of the world. Going in. Get ready. my money <laughs> my Taking candy from a baby. Ah, a thief! No, not my money! <sighs> you had to make this complicated. Now that I have your undivided attention, let me give you some advice. You've made a killing swindling the people living hand to mouth in this town. Now's your chance to put yourself in their shoes! Maybe you'll think twice about your dirty business practices now that you're the one who's lost all his money, huh? You should thank me, really. That's rich, coming from a common thief. How dare you! <laughs> Touché. But something tells me you'll get over it. Farewell. Try breaking a sweat with an honest day's work for a change. <laughs> Varlin thieves were known to sweep through towns, stealing ill-gotten goods from the undeserving rich. 
while their leader, Flame Khan, held down the remote desert fortress in the sand dunes. I've returned from the raid, sir. Well done. Oh, you haven't heard. Lord Fl Forgive me. King Flamecon has disbanded the Thieves' Guild and declared Navarre an independent nation under his rule. We're wasting away in this forsaken desert. Mana power is shifting and threatening our place in the world. Our people's resources, like the waters of the oasis, are drying up. Lay siege to the kingdom of Laurent in the north and create the Navarre Nation. Now, His Majesty has a meeting to attend, so you just sit tight. Hmm. Oh, Hawkeye! When did you get back? I is something wrong? What is Flamecon thinking? He's never been ashamed of our thievery before. How can we give up our entire livelihood, our creed? And for what? <sighs> what is going on? And there's something strange about that, Isabella. I know she saved the Lord's life when he was stranded in the desert. But making her second in command? What's her angle? I'm sure my father has the people's interests at heart, Hawkeye. If the wells we all depend on go dry, we can't live here forever. So... <sighs> but a king? Flamecon hates monarchies. So now we're going to bleed the citizens of our new nation dry to fill the king's pockets just like our enemies do? How will we be any different from them? Stop insulting my father! Oh, what? Did you want to play the part of the pretty little princess, Jessica? Stop!
Hawkeye, there's something bothering me. By now I'm sure you've heard about the invasion of Laron. Have you noticed anything strange about my father lately? That's exactly what I thought. We two have grown up together here in the fortress, so I knew you must have noticed it as well. I knew it. He hasn't truly been himself since he went missing in the dunes last month. Fortunately, that newcomer Isabella found him before he... But I swear, nothing has been the same since. If my hunch is correct, Isabella may be at the root of the problem. But no more. I will expose her for the evildoer she is. Get me a break, Eagle. Don't rush on ahead. Something's got me on edge. I better go after him. Shh. 
stay vigilant. Huh? We'll surround them. I'll go to the other side. Understood. Do pass on my message. Hold, fiend! We have you now. Whom have you snuck into the fortress? And what have you done to my father? We'll continue when pests are taken care of. I leave them to you. <laughs> oh! You children will find out there are things better left unseen in the world. But no matter. I will have you forget my little secret. Just like Flame Khan. Stop manipulating my father! I'll throw you out of this fortress myself! <laughs> what an innocent babe. It hurts! You? What's wrong? You have to... Run! Hawkeye! Must... Eliminate... Hawkeye... Must be destroyed. No, this isn't you, Eagle. Fight it. Oh dear, he can't hear you now. What will you do? Attack your friend or perish on his blade? Must defeat. Kill. Hawkeye! Eagle, stop this! I don't want to fight you! Alive, I see. Oh. Allow me to fix that. Ah! <laughs> Eagle! Eagle, no! Uh. You... You did this to Eagle! You foul! <laughs> <laughs> I'm done playing, child. <gasps> Someone, come quick. The man's a murderer. What's the problem? No. Not Eagle. How could you? Don't move. I would never! Let me out! Murder is no laughing matter. Your execution date is being decided. I suggest you reflect on your crimes while you wait. Best be quiet, dear. If you tell anyone, your friend Jessica's life is forfeit. What have you done to her? Oh, I just gave her a cursed little present, if you will. 
If you step out of line, you may not like the consequences. <laughs> Me out. Versus. Is someone there? Anyone? Jessica. My brother. Equal. He. They're saying you did it. But that can't be! No one was closer to my brother than you! You couldn't have! So tell me, who killed my brother? I... Talk, Talk and, and her life, life is forfeit. forfeit. Please... Tell me, who was it? <laughs> Hawkeye! Why won't you say anything? No. It couldn't be. But you... And Eagle? <gasps> Jessica! I believe Mew! I know Mew are framed! Come on! We need to get away from here as soon as possible! Ah! Uh, 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 quick! Through this hole! Isabella will pay, but I can't stick around Navarro any longer. This cursed purr, as and Mew mentioned, I think it's the legendary Choker of Death! If the stories are true, once Mew put it on, Mew can never take it off! And if Isabella dies, Jessica will die with her. But the Purist of Light in Holy City Wendell might have some leads! Mew should leave Navarro and find the Purist. <laughs> I'll take care of things here. What? Okay. I trust you, Niccolo. Take care of Jessica while I'm gone. Hey, you take care of me yourself. Don't worry, I'll look after Jessica. The prisoner's loose! Stop him!
illegal. Don't, don't worry. I swear on my life that I won't let anything happen to Jessica. I have to leave now, but... I will be back to avenge your death, dearest friend. And I will save your sister. Jessica, you have to stay safe until I return. Please be safe. Hawkeye, pained by the loss of his dear friend, set off for Wendell to find a way to lift Jessica's curse. to Ferolia. Don't resist, and we may spare you. Mm. Ferolian forces have taken the town and closed the docks. Now my ship's stuck in the harbor until who knows when. A Beastman invasion. <laughs> well, no one said this was gonna be easy. Picking a lock is child's play for a thief like me, but not with guards swarming the area. What's with that look, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Move along, human. If it's a fight you want. <clears throat> Wait. 
Where? <laughs> Feeling better? Don't go looking for trouble. Those brutes, they won't hold back. Give a girl some peace and quiet. Back off. You can't get anything past me. What kind of weapon shop doesn't sell weapons? If this is a joke, I ain't laughing. But come on, these beast guys are reaching for a fight! Eh, not sure if I can beat them all on my own, even if I had more weapons. Ow, oh, a headache. Welcome. Lots of wares to browse. <laughs> Come again. Keep your head down, and you won't get hurt. men of Ferolia look like humans during the day, but at night, they transform into animals. Don't leave the house after dark, you hear? Hey, if you're trying to leave the city, night is actually best. Once the beastmen transform, they lose their better judgment.
The whole lot of them tend to get together and brawl amongst themselves until dawn. It's easier to sneak out of the city then. Good luck. Perhaps someone can keep me company at the tavern until nightfall to uh, avoid these guards. On second thought, maybe it'd be better to rest at the end just in case. Quit gawking and get lost.
no one believes me, but I saw it. A strange light was floating over the lake. Maybe it'll appear tonight, too. Ha! <laughs> 
magic barriers in the way. These lockpicks are useless then. Yes, I should look elsewhere. Welcome, lots of wares to browse. <laughs> Come again.
Welcome! Light? Uh, strange light. Now I'm curious. It might be something valuable. I should check it out. You alive? I'm from Navarre, but I saw the light from the Astoria Inn. You can call me Hawkeye. I see. Oh, I have no other option. So I suppose you'll do. Hold on. What? Oh, never mind. I'll tell you later. Please, I need you to take me to the Priest of Light and Wendell. I can't fly any further on my own. That's actually where I'm headed anyway. But there's a barrier around the cavern. 
We're stuck here until further notice, I'm afraid. I can get us through the barrier. But we need to hurry. Something has happened to the Sanctuary of Mana. The Sanctuary of Mana? Wait. What on earth? That came from Astoria. Sorry, I, I gotta go back. Oh, we need to get going. Let me rest inside you for a bit. You won't see me, but don't worry, I'm still here. Whoa! Wait, what? Don't delay. We must see to Astoria. Uh, she's talking in my head. That is the weirdest feeling. Hurry! Okay, okay, I'm on it. So, why are you heading to Wendell? There's a small matter of a cursed choker that I need to figure out how to remove. Oh, I see you haven't had an easy time yourself. Where is everyone? This looks like the work of beastmen. What? Cowards! There is no time to waste. We have to get to the Priest of Light as soon as possible. Oh, Wendell is in danger.
in the way, I swear I'd be in Wendell by now. <laughs> it's not fair. Oh, funny story. Uh, you say a fairy's gonna help us get inside? Oh, you must mean the light from the forest. I am so glad she's your problem and not mine. Wow. No, thank you. So, is she gonna let us in or what? Oh, and you can help me get to Wendell, by the way. I could use a break. In Altena, the kingdom of magicians, the true queen's magic was all that kept the freezing temperatures of the surrounding snowy lands at bay. But, as the mana of the world grew weaker, so did her power. Bit by bit, the ice and cold began to encroach on the castle. Citizens, we all feel the magic draining from the land as mana weakens. For our mighty kingdom of Altena, this is of grave concern. We shall not sit idly while our country crumbles. No, no, we must open the forbidden portal to the Sanctuary of Mana, and then we can obtain the Sword of Mana. I thought that we tried to imagine what the magic is Be still. Legend says the portal to the Sanctuary of Mana only appears after activating the Mana Stones throughout the world. Obviously, no country would willingly give up a precious Mana Stone, so we expect a certain amount of resistance. We shall muster our strength and take the Mana Stones by force. Our true queen will obtain the Sword of Mana to rule her magic empire! Long live the true queen! Glory to Altena! Oh, come on, Jose! Please! Harsh! No need to shout, your highness. Honestly, you know, I used to be the sharpest of the great magic users in the Altanish court. <laughs> whoa, 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 hang on. I do not need another trip down your winding memory lane. Just teach me the rest of yesterday's lesson. <sighs> I've told you time and time again. You cannot use magic simply by learning the steps. Your magic has not manifested because you rely on form instead of spirit. 
Oh, please, not another lecture. Fine, I just won't ask for lessons anymore then. Take that. Oh, this child. Look, there's Victor. Hey, Victor, hey! Oh, uh, morning, your highness. Have you finished your magic lessons already? You know, Jose complains to me whenever you skip lessons, right? But please consider my plight next time, your highness. Angela, princess and heir to the throne of Altena. With a heavy burden dogging her steps, Angela grew up fatherless in the shadow of her mother's royal duties. Her childhood was extremely lonely. Instead of affection from her mother, it seemed all she received were scoldings. Though she knew that the queen had important responsibilities that kept the two from playing, that knowledge didn't stop Angela's frustrated tears. Starved for attention, the princess grew into a rebellious youth. She often acted out, playing pranks on members of the court. Though Angela became a renowned beauty, much like her mother, she remained woefully unable to wield the magic power of her bloodline. That lack of talent was never far from her mind. Ugh. I'm so bored. Why does nothing ever happen around here?
wizard is training the mages harder than ever. I heard some were injured, but I suppose that's one of the dangers of war. I'm not sure, but the Crimson Wizard might be as powerful as Her Majesty the Queen now. Oh, there you are! Uh, Your Highness, the Queen and her advisor have called for you. Uh, I will wait for you in the gardens. Now is not the time to dawdle. Please hurry, Your Highness. This is urgent! Her Majesty is preparing our troops to invade Valsena across the sea! We must go to her, Your Highness. Uh, Your Majesty. I believe you sent for me. Angela, allow me to explain. As you know, we must control the Mana Stones to gain access to the Sanctuary. That is the reason for our... Uh, invasion. Legend says if we activate the energy of the Mana Stones in the world, the portal will open. And we don't question legend. We shall begin with the Altenish Mana Stone. Uh, how will you do that? We will use a forbidden magic spell, outlawed because it takes the life of the Enchanter in exchange for that mana energy. However, my associate and I are too important for this sacrifice. If we use your body as a vessel for that cursed magic, your death would act as the catalyst we need to release the Mana Stone's true power. But, 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 Mother! You've been a useless blight on my lineage for far too long. To think that my daughter could be so weak and powerless. Under these circumstances, sacrificing yourself for the spell is the most fitting end for my heir. Now come, my child. N n no No! She's gone. Hmm. Ah. Uh. Where? I'm outside the castle. But... Why? Why would my mother... I can't return. I can't return, but I have no idea what to do now. Wasn't there a village to the east? That might be my only option at this point.
I actually won, I think. Another step. I want to go home. Please, Mother. Please. Where am I?
good, you're awake. My daughter found you in the snowfields. Hmm? We brought you back to Ulrent. Please rest until you feel well. Cheery, look! Our guest woke up! <laughs> Yay! Can I play with her? Huh? Can I? No, don't bother her. But I'll play with you. walk to boost my mood. Welcome! Lots of wares to browse! I'll make use of this! <laughs> Come again! Welcome! Lots of wares to browse! <laughs> Come again! Guidance. Hmm. 
Sometimes people lose any last spark of hope and fall into the deepest despair. <laughs> when that happens, you must go to Holy City Wendell and seek advice from his eminence, the Priest of Light. The Priest of Light? To find your way through the darkness of despair, you will need a guiding light. Go to Wendell, child. That is your fate. Huh? Come on! This fraud told me the same thing. <laughs> Go to Wendell or whatever. All I asked was whether my next child was going to be a boy or a girl. City Wendell, huh? I don't know what awaits me there, but I guess it's bound to be better than getting caught here in my own kingdom. I'll go. I mean, nothing could possibly be worse than staying cooped up in the castle. And if I learn how to handle my magic, maybe my mother will welcome me back. There's a chance, at least. Heart heavy with the Queen's rejection. Angela left Altena as a wanted criminal with a price on her head. <laughs> oh, how silly of me. I never asked your name. Hawkeye, huh? All right then. Lead on, Hawkeye. Give me a moment. I'll get rid of the barrier. There. You should be fine now. You're pretty competent for a party of one. Well, as the princess of Altena, I've had training. I'll take monsters over the Altanish forces any day. Seems this is a good travel arrangement for all of us. <laughs> Time to work together, everyone! <laughs> Huh? Too bad.
each other. <laughs> Of them. Don't get too comfortable, though. Wander through these monster dens alone. Got it. I grew up with no parents, but there was one priest in Wendell that was always nice to me. Heath was kind and helpful. He took care of me. My grandpa asked Heath to go to Astoria to look into something for the temple. But I got a really, really bad feeling about it. I didn't want anything to happen to Heath. So I followed him in secret and didn't tell Grandpa when I left the temple that night. By a horrible twist of fate, a creepy-looking man took Heath away right when I finally found him again! <laughs> and then I couldn't even get back to Wendell because of the barrier! Until you opened a path through the cavern for me! I got a little 
lost on the way. And fell down. <laughs> if you hadn't been there. Good night, Charlotte. That was close. <sighs> well, I'm headed toward Wendell to see the Priest of Light anyway. You can follow along for now, I guess. Come on. Oh, you want to see Grandpa? Why didn't you say so? You didn't know it, but you helped your chances. I'm actually the granddaughter of the Priest of Light. But, you know, Wendell isn't far from here. You might need my help getting there, but I don't need your help getting home. Take care that you don't get lost. Bye-bye! That's a girl who knows what she wants. If only she were ten years older. That was the last of them. Don't get too comfortable, though. Finally made it to Wendell. Hopefully his eminence knows how to lift curses. Thank you so much for taking me here. Hurry, we need to request an audience with his eminence.
Welcome! Lots of wares to browse! Oh, good choice. <laughs> Looks useful. Oh, good choice. I love shopping. <laughs> Come again. Welcome! Lots of wares to browse! I have an eye for quality. Oh, good choice. I'll make use of this. <laughs> Come again! Welcome! Lots of wares to browse! Oh, good choice! <laughs> Come again!
please, accept the Goddess of Manor's blessings. Your Eminence, what do you know about the Choker of Death? How can I stop the curse? I need to save Jessica. Choker of Death? But that's a forbidden and ancient magic. How did this come to be? Here's the story. Hmm. I am certain that Isabella is not what she seems. Hawkeye, my apologies. But I do not know how to lift a curse so ancient and evil. Only the goddess of mana can do that. Only the mana goddess? That can't be. What am I supposed to do now? So, you're the Priest of Light, hmm? You're... plainer than I expected. I was hoping you might have some wisdom to share. Whoa! Wait! I have something to say! Your Evidence, please listen! I have come from the Sanctuary of Mana to tell you that the Mana Tree is withering! Mana power grows weaker by the day. Withering? But without the mana tree, the seals on the mana stones will break. The Benevidons will be released into the world. The uh, what? Uh, come again? You're acting like this doesn't affect you. You've been chosen by fairy. This means that you alone can retrieve the Sword of Mana from the Sanctuary. I've been what now? She didn't mention that. Hey, Fairy, what's this about? I'm sorry. With the mana in the world so depleted, a Fairy can't leave the Sanctuary for long without a host. If I hadn't found you, I wouldn't have made it. Yeah, okay. You're welcome and all that, but you're not welcome anymore. Go haunt the old man over there instead, hmm? Would that I were able to bear your burden. However, once a fairy finds a host, they are bound to them for their whole life. Only death can part them. Wait one second. I never agreed to this. I don't need a sort of manner or whatever. You want revenge on the person who killed your friend Eagle, and to lift the curse on Jessica, right? The Sword of Mana could break any curse, and it can destroy Isabella. Hey, keep your fairy fingers out of my head. What is the Sword of Mana anyway? The Sword of Mana is the embodiment of the ancient power of mana. Guiding force of spirits. It is an alternate form of the golden wand used to create the world itself. The one who holds the mana sword gains awesome power. The sword lies in the roots of the mana tree, waiting. Before the mana tree withers completely, you must reclaim the sword and awaken the goddess of mana once more. She alone can bring peace to the realm and grant your wish. I could destroy Isabella for what she did to Eagle. <laughs> I'll do anything to save Jessica. So, where can I find this sanctuary of mana exactly? I'm so sorry, but with mana so depleted, I don't have enough power to open the portal to the sanctuary, not by myself. Throughout the world are eight points of mana energy, mana stones, sealing away the fearsome Benevidons. If you activate the mana stones, the portal connecting our world to the sanctuary of mana should appear. Through 
That portal is the sanctuary. However, you should know that the energy inside the eight mana stones was sealed on purpose as the mana goddess began her slumber. So what should I do? In ages past, there once was an ancient spell used to control the energy from the mana stones and bend it to the user's will. However, countries refused to allow each other any control of the spell and use of the mana stones. The war that followed caused unspeakable damage. It was nearly as destructive as the sealed Benevidons. The survivors cursed the magic to avoid future tragedy and forbade anyone from using it. Now the life of any person who uses the spell will be forfeit. There is no longer anyone alive who knows how to work this cursed spell. Guess that's it then. There may be one way. If we borrow the powers of the elemental spirits that reside near the mana stones instead, I can combine their powers with what remains of mine to open the portal for everyone! Splendid! This is a relief. If you wish to find a mana stone, I've heard many say that the light stone is in Cascade Cavern, guarded by the elemental Lumina. It is the cavern you pass through in order to reach here. Take Fairy. With what remains of her power, she can help you find Lumina in the cavern. See if you may borrow his light powers. So... wait. Huh. I think my mother mentioned that thing. But if I can get it before her... I can show her that I'm not powerless. She might even let me come back. Hey, take me with you. Please, come on. Certainly. And the more elementals we meet, the more magic you can learn yourself. Really? That's perfect.
welcome. you were talking to Grandpa about. You are no simple adventurer. Since you have a quest of your own, I have a favor to ask. I gotta find Heath, and I need your help. No can do, little lady. This journey is way too dangerous for a child. I can't promise you'll be safe. Now, go on home to your grandfather, okay? Don't worry. We'll find out what happened to Heath for you. Leave it to us. Hey, come on! I'm just worried about Heath. Please! I really can't come with you. Oh, fine. You are so stubborn. And mean. You, you, you meanie? Get this nuisance out of the way before we can go. on me. Okay. We're getting too good for these guys. You wish you had cross paths with us. Let's 
focus on finding Lumina. Okay. Of course. I need to learn how to use magic no matter what. the whole fairy was talking about, right? How are we supposed to get over there? Oh, right. I forgot you can't fly. I think I can use the residual mana power in the waterfall to get you over there. Hmm. Let's give it a try. out of the way before we can go. Uh -huh. Potential feels limitless. Of them. Don't get too comfortable, though. Come on! Let's help each other! You win! Strength is flowing through me! It's magical! Should do it.
last of them. <laughs> Don't get too comfortable, though. No, this isn't the elemental we're looking for. It's a giant monster. So why do I feel mana power coming off of it? Mana? Ugh, this isn't a normal monster, is it? It doesn't matter. We need to take care of this first, right? <laughs> 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 What a waste of time. Now think so. Is that? Hey yo, looking for Lumina? That'd be me. Nice to meet ya. A pleasure. And thanks for releasing me from the belly of that full metal meanie. Am I right? <sighs> Who knows what would have happened if you hadn't come? <sighs> Fairy filled me in on your plight while you were fighting. Telepathy's great, huh? Just like Fairy, we elementals need mana to live. I'll help however I can to make sure we save the mana of the world. Lumina, where is the Lightstone? It's straight up from here, deep within the old ruins. But you can't exactly get there from here. Oh, no, 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 no. It's safe, though. For now, at least. It's so unstable. It seems like the Benebidon could be unsealed at any minute. We gotta get the rest of the elementals on board and open the portal to the sanctuary! Huh? Look at that! A shortcut!
的危机。Taking down the cavern barrier saved us some trouble. <laughs> Now nothing's stopping us. From This is a present to show our appreciation. No! <laughs> Let's get going. What do I do? 